favourite time of day, being a coffee and talking to my chickens. You see the other ones? Here you go. Want to fly off? Off you go. You want to go for a fly? You want to go for a swing? Look, she wants to stay and swing. Hey, you like that? Go down for a swing. Where did we get these at Mapleton? Yeah, at Mapleton at the market yesterday. Mm. So they're 50 cents each, mm. and the seeds come from Green Harvest, which is a nursery in Witter. And then that lovely husband and wife that we met at Mapleton Markets, so they sell those for 50 cents each. So that's pretty good. Asian greens and these ones are spinach or the other way around, <laughs> either way. So this is a little bit exciting. Last night we went to Kmart and we bought this sushi making kit and it was only $10. Looks like it makes making sushi really easy. And of course, sushi's pretty healthy for you and we love sushi. It's a great thing to take on picnics. So we thought we'd give it a go really quickly so you can see what's involved. Here we go. So we've got our rice, it's prepared and it's cooled down. We've got some smoked salmon. We've got some sliced cucumber, sliced avocado, cream cheese, and nori sheet on a bamboo mat. And this is our little contraption from Kmart. And I have gloves on because I'll be handling the food. Make sure it's kind of even. So if there's any little bits that are missing, don't have as much, just put a little bit extra in. So I'll just squash it down a bit. Then with this part, I can actually squash it down more to make that center line. Put my ingredients in so that's perfect. For the first one I'm going to put some salmon in and I love I love red salmon so smoked salmon it is and it's delicious so we can be a bit generous and now we'll put some cream cheese in. Not really sure how I do that but I've got gloves on so it's okay I can smooth it over a bit. Should I put something else in here or do you think more smoked salmon? Cucumber. Cucumber? Mm. Okay. What do you think? Let's go. Okay. Screw this end on here. That's it. That's tight. I can feel a bit of pressure. And that's good because we want to make it nice and tight and ready. How easy is, is that it? Yeah. yeah. You'll need to go down a bit lower with the camera, I think. Mm -hmm. See how, how easy does that make it? It looks professional, doesn't it? 
Ta-da. Good job. Gee, whoever did that rice did a good job. <laughs> I can tidy that up in a minute. And I just need to wet my hands at the very end. Okay, not a bad first effort. Ta-da! Excellent. Excellent? Mm. So much cheaper to do it yourself at home. What do you think? They look professional, don't they? I'm excited about this one today because we're only a 10 minute drive from Landsborough and we're at Ewan Maddock Dam. And Ewan Maddock Dam is a perfect place to have a barbecue or a picnic. So there's playgrounds here, you can paddleboard, you can fish, you can swim, you can bring your dog. There's lots of things and they have lots of fantastic walks. So I'm starving. It's actually late in the afternoon. Oh, someone just had a swim. It's actually late in the afternoon. So we're gonna have some lunch and then we're gonna take you for a walk. Pretty good spot for a picnic, don't you think? Look, sushi, I made. Mmm. Mmm. It's so fresh, it tastes so good. It's still very mild. It's a typical autumn day. It's getting cooler at night time now, but the days are also getting a little cooler. I think today probably got to about 28 or 30 degrees, but overnight it got down to 14, which is the coldest that we've had this year. So you can definitely feel that the temperature's changing. Really beautiful here, isn't it? It is, never been here. We've never been here before. <laughs> How far is it from our place? Maybe half an hour from our place. Yeah, yeah. But it's about 10 minutes from Landsborough. Yeah. And Landsborough is about 10 minutes off the Bruce Highway. Yep. Opposite the Caloundra turn off. Mm. And it's late in the afternoon and it's there's beautiful. children swimming and there's adults on a paddle board. Very mild. It's very mild. And it's just so beautiful, isn't it? Well, I hope you've enjoyed having a little look around. We like showing you somewhere new, and especially when it's somewhere that we haven't been before. But even in this video, we're doing a bit of autumn in yeah, the hinterland. Yeah, we've done a, yeah, we've done a, yeah. shown you a, a little bit of the hinterland, because yep. it does really change season does. to season, doesn't it? You wouldn't think so. When we first came up to Queensland, I thought, oh, it's the same year round, but it's when you live here, you do see the differences. It's so true. Yeah. See, nice clean barbecues. Barbecues with a view. And they're free. Mm. And I got the voucher. Thank you so much. Oh, did you? Oh, it, was, it was just too much. Oh, oh, happy birthday. Thanks. Yes. Well, look at there you go. Cheers. <laughs> Yeah, there's your present. Thanks. Oh, money. <laughs> Sensational. Thank you very much. Thank you, Paul. Happy birthday, Steve. <laughs> Happy birthday. Can I just ask you one question? Yeah. So, now that you're officially old, what advice would you give your 20 year old self? Oh, go back to school. Go back Honestly, to school. go back go back to school. That's all it's time. So, That's good school. advice. This is my niece, Keely. <laughs> it's beautiful. Did you show the gardens? It's so tropical and beautiful, isn't it? And right on the water. That's Hummer Stone Passage there. Hi. Thanks everyone for coming for Dad's 60th. Um, young fella. He's a good, fun young man. <laughs> um, and I yeah. hope today reflects that. <laughs> Here's some other 60 years of Stephen McGrath. <laughs> Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Stephen. Happy birthday to you. here at 
7.30 and it's now 3.30 and we're about to go home but we thought we'd just walk down to the water and show you some of Pumice Stone Passage. Way over there in the distance, I don't know if you can see it, but that's the Glasshouse Mountains. And we're about, probably about 40 minutes drive from the Glasshouse Mountains here at Sandstone Point Hotel. And we've had a lovely time uh, talking, drinking, eating with the family. 